गुड मॉर्निंग वेलकम टू टेक टेंट टी यू टेक्नोलॉजी एंड कंप्यूटर ट्यूटोरियल ब्लॉग टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू हाउ टू कॉन्फिगर डी एस सी पी सर्वर इन विंडोज सर्वर टू थाउजेंड एट इट्स डी सी पी सर्वर यूज टू असाइन आई पी एच डे एड्रेस टू द क्लाइंट कंप्यूटर प्रीवियस वीडियो आई टोल्ड अबाउट वॉट इज डी एस सी पी सर्वर नाउ लेट्स सी हाउ टू कॉन्फिगर डी एस पी सर्वर इन विंडोज टू थाउजेंड एट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल ओपन योर विंडोज सर्वर टू थाउजेंड एट एंड देन क्लिक ऑन सर्वर मैनेजर डैशबोर्ड इट्स अ सर्वर मैनेजर डैशबोर्ड ऑन फ्रॉम विच यू कैन एड सर्विस एंड कॉन्फिगर डी सी पी सर्वर फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू हैव टू एड रोल क्लिक ऑन एड रोल एड रोल फ्रॉम हेयर और क्लिक ऑन एक्शन मिनू एंड देन क्लिक ऑन एड रोल नाउ क्लिक ऑन नेक्स्ट ऑन द बिफोर यू बिगेन स्क्रीन क्लिक ऑन नेक्स्ट देन सेलेक्ट डी सी बी सर्वर रोल क्लिक ऑन चेक बॉक्स टू नेबल इट एंड देन क्लिक ऑन नेक्स्ट नाउ इट्स इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ डी सी बी सर्वर now here click next and its uh, network adapter ip address there there is only one network adapter in a, this computer that's why it's showing only one if there is multiple network adapter then it will it show multiple ip address now click on next is window next now if you share your domain name then type if you share your domain name with client then type your domain name then if you also want to share your dns ip address then type the dns ip address to share with your client now click on next now it's ask for if bin server has been bin server install on your computer then select means required for the on this network otherwise bin is not required select bin is not required for this application this network click on next now here you have to add dsp scope dsp scope is a range of ip address which from which dsp server assign ip address within the range which you will assign in this this scope now let's create range of the ip address now type the scope name type your scope name you can type anything and then type the put the starting ip address which you want to assign to the client 168.1.11 and 192.168.1.20 is starting ip address is a int ip address now provide the list duration and select activate this scope check box if you enable this check box then after create dcp server configure dcp server your scope will automatic activate then click on okay after create scope it's a range of the ip address then click on next if you want to configure dcp version 6 then click on enable otherwise if you want to enable ip version 6 then select enable dcp version 6 state let mode for this server now click on next now put here your now put your domain name for ip version 6 tag your com now click on next now it's a summary of the configuration which you have done then click on install to installation of dcp role on your server now installing dcp role 
and configure your DSP server. It will take some time to configure. Now you will see DSP server has been installed on DSP server and role has been installed on your server. Now you can check DSP server installed or not. Now click on roles, expand it. Now expand DSP server. Now you will see DSP server has been installed on your computer. Now is a green checkbox which means DSP server has been installed. Now you can check its scope. It says scope address pool address leech. Refresh it. Then it will show this IP address provided to the client computer. Now check. Go to your client computer. Go to your client computer and check which IP address provided by DSP server now you can see here IP version 4 address has been client has been assigned to the client computer now you can see leads obtained this much 30 this much Now you can see this server has been configured on our server 2008 and also and it's also provide IP address to the client computer. Now here you can change your DSP scope. You can change here your DSP scope. Now if new client added in your network then new client will added in the address release thanks for listening this video have a nice day